this guy right here. Do we have ourselves a deal? Today, only one thing stands in our way for a complete Pokemon 151 binder, and it's this dude right here. There's two spots missing in the Pokemon card binder. The other one goes to a special illustration rare, Venusaur EX. Venusaur is in this package that I traded another Pokemon content creator for. But before we open up the package, comment what is the one Pokemon card that you are on the search for right now for your collection. We need Mr. Mime before we can open that up, and I know exactly where we should go. Tonight is Pokemon League at my local card game shop, The Danger Room in Anderson, Indiana. And by the end of today's video, we are completely Pokemon 151 and I think we might be able to get the last card we need inside of here so let's go do some trades and see what else we can find. Pokemon League every Wednesday here at the card game shop. Oh. <laughs> also uh, let's note <laughs> I almost just slipped right there. Okay let's go inside before I get hurt. Okay so we're signed in over here and we got our prize packs just for just for attending just for attending we'll open these up later do you think Radiant Charizard is inside of here? Busy night here at League. Even Marie brought her deck as well. Look at this, packed in here. There's lots of potential trades gonna happen. Mark, you're the only person in the world collecting jumbos, I think. I think so. <laughs> I mean, maybe. I have, you, I have you a binder. Literally, you literally always ask for the jumbos whenever I get them. Yeah. Right? Yeah, I got a binder. Look at that. That's for the raids. You have some older ones, these, some these vintage the, ones. These are the ones that I'll play with. Okay, those. Are, so those are the only good ones is what you're these saying. These are the good ones that like, you have a good battle. Now for, for weeks, literally for weeks, Mark has been asking me, hey, can you bring that uh, legendary birds from the mystery box, yeah. all right? And I keep forgetting. I literally keep forgetting, all right? Um, I'm supposed to be giving one of these to Mark, but I keep forget forgetting to bring it to Lee, so. Uh, Mark, it's coming, I promise. What is it? I will bring it. The one week I remember, you traded for I it traded this week. I traded for another one. Th but this I'm week? Taking. Yeah. What? I, I, I can't believe you, Mark. I can't believe you. This is this. But, but if you this, you want another one, yours yours is going in here. Okay, we got to see it go into the binder, so we got proof, evidence, is right it here. A, is it a whoop? Oh yeah, it'd be a it's way lower, bigger lower, one. Yeah, lower. <laughs> okay, Mark's trying to uh, finish Obsidian Flames. That's all you need, yeah. right there. Well, the reverse is, but, reverses, but yeah, the main set. There. The main one's right there. Okay, so I'm gonna look at this binder here and see if I have any. I'm pretty sure I have that Pidgeot, Dragonite EX. Hmm, Palafin. Oh, wait, I got the Palafin. Okay, yeah, I can definitely help you out here. All right, let's take a look through Mark's binder and see if we can find anything we need because he has picked out a certain Charizard that he wants, and I'm sure that I'm going to need something in here to complete one of my sets. Oh, nice. We see Lechonk down there, Gloom, Bombardier, Miriam, a bunch, a bunch of Radiance. Mark's pulled a ton of Radiance. Oh, and another? Wasn't there one back here? Another Secret Rare fire energy what, didn't we just see one back here yeah look boom two of them bunch of random exs and v's we've hit the conclador page i think what's going to come down to is i want to check my list and see if i need any of these stuff i actually might need some of these pre-release promos because i don't have all of the scarlet and violet ones and i'm missing like three or four from the sword and shield era for the promos mark just has to have the charizard Charizard promo. Yeah. Palafin, Hound Dower, those two you need for your Obsidian Flames. Yeah. That's for a deck. Yes. How's the deck doing? It's doing pretty good. <laughs> it didn't sound too positive. <laughs> we'll see how it does in Knoxville. You're officially announcing your participation in Knoxville. I am participating in Knoxville. Okay. That All might right. be the deck. I might pivot at the last minute. Who knows? I'm going for this nice uh, fuller <laughs> boss's orders and the Canto vibes with the Pidgey illustration rare. So those two for those three right there. Deal? Deal. Boom, it's a deal. All right, Hudson, what'd you pick out? All right, so I have picked out both Radiant for Ninja and Professor's Research, the Sada version. The Sada version, right? Both of them going into the deck? Yep. Okay, I need the Poly Whirl right here. So those two for that one? Yep. Deal? Yep. Boom, it's a deal. Now, next up, we're going into a little bit of a vintage looking binder situation with some stickers on the front, too. Nice little sparkly Charmander sticker. Ooh, look at this. Blastoise right there. We got the uh, Reshiram GX. Got some shiny Pokemon as well. I do have all of the shiny Pokemon from Shining Fate, so I don't need to worry about that. However, that sleeve is absolutely adorable with a score bunny sleeping on the Snorlax. Are you kidding me? Radiant Charizard, but not the Radiant Charizard we're looking for. We're trying to find the prize pack one. Eventually, I'm not like going out of my way to find it. Vaporeon EX, now that's one of the World Championship deck ones. You can tell by the signature right there and the silver border on that one. I'm not, I don't remember what year that was. I wanna say like 2007. Oh no, right here, 2005, I was close. We got back here in the XY era 
and then go into black and white era with this Rayquaza, 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 the break Pokemon cards. I don't feel like they were that popular when it came to collecting playability wise. There was definitely some good ones. Greninja was really, really good. But other than that, people don't seem to be a huge fan of them. Oh, some nice tag teams down here with the Sylveon Gardevoir. And we got, oh, that's actually on the next page. This is still beyond Gardevoir. We got the Arceus, Dialga, and Palkia, ADP. Actually might need that Trevenant EX from Primal Clash. Oh, the Rainbow ADP down here. Oh, you don't see that one too much in binders. I already have it, but it's kind of tempting to get another one. Some Pokemon celebrations up here. We got some vintage Pokemon cards. Dark Gyarados with the pre-release stamp. Latias right here. The reverse holo Delta species Latias. Oh, okay. That one's caught my attention too. Okay, so definitely gonna check the list and see if I need that Trevenant EX, that full art Trevenant EX, because uh, that, I think that one caught my attention the most flipping through this binder. I just don't, I don't know. That weirdly, that one just kind of like struck a chord with me. I was like, I want that one. All right, we got a quick trade. You wanted the illustration rare at LeChonk and the Sencino, I need the Sencino right here. Hollow rare Sencino goodness from black and white era. So we're gonna do LeChonk for Sencino. We have ourselves, hang on, we have ourselves a deal. Boom, it's a deal. The night is still going strong and we're looking through another binder and uh, I already took a quick glance at it, but there was a couple things that kind of caught my mind. Obviously a bad glare going on here from the lights up above. There we go, much better. But I still weirdly enough have not gotten those. Like technically I already have them, but I don't have the version with the little snowflake stamp right there on it. So those are ones that I would possibly go after, but I'm trying to fight the urge to collect all of the prize pack cards. Like that's gonna be way too much, but I'm seeing them everywhere and I feel like it'd be kind of fun to have a binder of all the prize pack cards. So the Ampros EX down there is catching my attention. I probably should just like try to trade for it in case I do make the decision to try to get all the prize pack cards, but I feel like it's a bad idea. But let me know, let me know in the comment section. Do you think I should collect all of the prize pack cards? Also that Lugia EX, whew, maybe. All right, so we ended up working out a deal here. It's not official yet though. Hisuian Samurai V-Star from Crown Zenith and a full art Darkrai GX from Burning Shadows back in the Sun and Moon era. So we're gonna do those two for this right here, Lugia EX. It's not like super mint, but it is binder quality. And that is good enough for me. So, so those two for that one right here, we have ourselves a deal. Boom, it's a deal. We still got time. We still got some time to do some trading. You see a lot of a lot of games still going on. A lot of people wrapping up their games as well. But it's a good night here at Pokemon League. And we're looking in another binder right here. Now he's over here looking for some Paradox Rift. So we're gonna see if we have any extra to Paradox Rift in there, but we're gonna see if possibly there's anything in here that we might need. There's always something. I still need uh, a Snorlax with the Pokemon Center logo on it, as well as the Iron Bundle and Screamtail. I need both of those with the Pokemon Center logo on it. I've got the Gold Coridon. Oh, I might have to check and see if I need that illustration rare. That's a possibility. Even that Tarantula, I might. All right, what did you end up picking out over here? Larry, yes, the Larry that I got from Paul the week prior that I did not want is actually coming in handy now. <laughs> and then we got the Chi Yu and the Edge Slash. <laughs> and over here, I need I need the special illustration Wu Chen right here from Paldea Evolved. So we're gonna do those three for that one. We have ourselves a deal. We do. All right. Boom! It's a deal. Wait, what do we have over here? Oh, just Mr. A Mr. Mime. Mime, the one card I need to complete my set. He's got the Mr. Mime, and I need it. I need that Mr. Mime. Please tell me you found something in the binder that you need. Um, something. You, ju you just keep looking. You just keep looking, right? Perfect trade, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> things like a five dollar Well, you know what? You might have other cards that I need, so we don't have to go card for card here. All right, we're getting a little sidetracked here from this other trade, but look at this nice Charmander and Charmeleon from Stormfront. And we're trading next for these, right? The Entei and, and Suicune you also brought to trade for me. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> no, those are nice. Those are those are really nice. I know you're big into the swirls, right? And there's a swirl on there. 
Where, where's those swirls at? Oh, I think I see one. On, oh, yeah, there we go. Boom. I don't know if I see one on Charmeleon. Oh, yeah, there we go. Okay. Those are, those are very nice cards. Wish I wish I had some. Jeez. Just wish I had some. Okay, so do, I think we worked out a trade, right? For, for Mr. Mime? Yeah. Did we work out a trade for Mr. Mime? Where's Where's Mr. Mime at? Right here. Oh, there we go. Trading for the Mr. Mime right here. A oh, wrong one. Okay. Mr. Mime right here. This right here is Charizard and Brakeson GX from Cosmic Eclipse. However, this is a French one. Yeah, a French version of it. We're going to do a trade here, right? Card for card for the Mr. Mime. And that will complete the set. Do we have ourselves a deal? Oh, it's a deal. Yes. Yes. Now, here's the thing. Oh, I got to get I got to get out real fast. It's not officially complete until all the cards are in the binder. So we have to go home and put the Mr. Mime into the binder along with the card from the special package. And both of those will complete the set. Oh, it's a good day. It's a good day. Back here in the studio and we have all the binders laid out because we made some Pokemon trades tonight and we officially have to add them into the library starting off with the Lugia EX from the Plasma era. Now, breaking family, we are officially completing Pokemon 151 today. Here is the binder. However, we got to work our way there. We also got to open up this package. We got to see if we have a Radiant Charizard from these prize packs. So let's continue onward right here going into the next set with legendary treasures we get that sencino whoop moving on at two oh this set this set's getting a lot closer to being completed we got paldea evolved with the Wu chin right here the nice special illustration Wu chin whoop and that is actually completing that page right there i mean how awesome is that we're still missing a few others as well but that kind of completes the page and i guess i should have shown you like some of this other stuff over here from like plasma plasma goodness look at this right back here we got the nice uh Colrus, full art goodness we got that articuno i don't know if you happen to have seen the uh the gold zekrom that we have all the way hang on hang on back here look at that gold zekrom in the very back. Man, I'm missing two of the Radiant Collection, three of the Radiant Collections as well. Beautiful, beautiful stuff. However, that is a discussion for a different video. Breaking Family 151. The whole point of today's Pokemon video is officially completing Pokemon 151. We got the Mr. Mime. However, Breaking Family, I don't think we can just go right into it because it's not officially complete until it's in the binder. I don't think we can just go right into it. No, no, Marie, I think we gotta we gotta open up our prize packs that first. That is true. Okay, starting off with your Series 3 prize pack. Now, the big one from Series 3 is that Radiant Charizard. And remember, I need you all to let me know down in the comment section, should I create a binder specifically for the prize pack cards? Oh, and there we go. We got the energy, and there is the code card. So, unfortunately, I no no Radiant Charizard, but you did get this Hisuian Basculin, which has a different hollow foil. Well, it's not a different one. It's the only hollow foil <laughs> pattern this Hisuian Basculin has. And you got the nice uh, Grodal that also has a hollow foil pattern. But, yeah, should I create a binder specifically for the prize pack cards? There's a lot of them. All right, there's mine. That would be a big binder. I'm not sure if you know, Breaking Family, how many cards are in the prize pack series, but it's a lot. It's a lot. There's, there's series one, series two, and series three. I mean, there's a lot going on there, so it would be a hard task for sure. So would you get a binder for each series? Or just I, that's one? the thing. I don't know. Would I get a binder for each series? I think you'd have you, to. You all got to let me know down in the know. comments. You got to let me know what's the best way I should be doing this. Um, all right. We got the generator. We got a Miriam going into a Reggie Rock. Hey. I literally could just get the exact same thing as you. I think you did. If there is a Grodel behind there, I'm, I'm going to be gonna very upset. It. I'm going to love it. And, oh, oh nice. Right. This is so weird. Didn't you, you get this last week? Last week, I got the V Star. And now I got the, the Gudra right. V. Well, I, I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining at all. There's the code card right there. I would say I won that that pack battle right agree. there. I would agree, yeah. Yeah, that's yeah. unfortunate. Pokemon card opening win goes to Real Breaking Nate. 
because we're in this room. All right, now I did a trade with a fellow content creator, one of my best friends, Super Duper Danny, was helping them complete their uh, Paradox Rift binder. And uh, the, the video is on their channel if you want to go and watch that. You have something that I would like? They tried completing it. Uh, I won't let you know if they were successful or not, but... I did make a trade, and uh, the Venusaur EX, Special Illustration Venusaur EX, is in one of these, and I'm pretty sure Danny, uh, <laughs> uh, because there's a thing that happened here, and uh, uh, I sent Danny a very taped up package. Bro, are you serious? And I think Danny I is like returning the favor. I feel like this is only fair, yeah. If you go and watch their video, you'll understand what this is all about. Uh, we got, oh, we got some more cards right here. Let's see, Aww. let's see what we got here. Oh, Look at the Growly a Gang! Little, a little Growly! Oh, let's open this up. We got how? Oh, look at that! <laughs> we got the the Togepi. Love I believe, that! I believe that's the Swagapi. Shut up! That's adorable. We got uh, we got Pikachu. We got the Super Duper Pikachu Danny Danny. sticker right there. Oh, look at this. We got all sorts of good. Yeah, I need I need these, and we I mean we made trades for other stuff as well. Super duper tutorials. That's an old. Wow. That's an old <laughs> one right there. Pokemon Center logo. I Ooh, needed that one. I that. needed that for the promo binder. I didn't have, have that it. one yet. But some of these, I think I think I acquired some of these since uh, <laughs> since, since Danny sent trade. out the package. Oh wow. But I still need, I believe, that one. Uh, wait, is that Pal Paldea? Wait a minute. Is it? Yeah. Yeah, let's add in here. Okay. Uh, I believe I do have the armor root. Look at that. Right there. Uh, obviously, I'm gonna have to check my other binders and see what I ended up trading for. And that's not all. Look at this. We got some booster packs. Stop. We got some booster packs here as well. Evolving skies. What else have we got in here? Oh, there's a note. There's a note. I see a note. There's a note. This could be. Is it dangerous that there's a note in here? Probably. All right. Here we go. If you pull. <laughs> If you pull a Roaring Moon in these, you'll be uh, hearing from my lawyer. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so a Roaring Moon, special illustration Roaring Moon is what I traded uh, Super Duper Danny for uh, for all of this right here. That's hysterical. Can I, mean, I open it, them? It, that'd be kind of funny if there was one in it here, would. I right? I kind of want to open these like right now. I mean, it only makes sense. <laughs> all right, Super Duper Danny, here we go. <laughs> Let's see if there is a Roaring Moon special illustration in here. Did I just earn my Roaring Moon back? How wild so would that funny. be? Okay, Roaring Moon, here we go. Oh, oh, look at that, Mousehold EX. We do love a Mousehold. One Ultra Rare right there. We got how many packs? One, two, three, four, five, six total right here. We still got 151 to complete. This is wild. It's a good video today. Good Pokemon opening. All right, Espothra, okay. Espothra. Okay. Energy, put that in the filing cabinet. Oh my. Going into the next one. I can feel it on this one. This one, I feel like I feel like we got some goodness in here. We got that Roaring Moon. No. Oh, they got that low kick. Okay, three more. Danny, Danny, you're safe so far. You're safe. No special illustration Roaring Moon. We got ourselves a Dweeble Joltik going into a Don Dozo. Wow, okay, Evil Tall Energy. All right, Danny. Zubat, we got a cape, Cyclozar, and an iron moth. Energy, one more. Will this have the Roaring Moon in it? Dun, dun, dun. You think so? You think it might have the Roaring Moon? It might. Or we might have the Moon Breon. Oh. Moon, moon, double moons right here. Double moons all the way. <laughs> here we go. We have ourselves a another Loudred, a Pumpkaboo, a Zubat, and you are safe. Super duper Danny, you're safe. However, can you imagine if there was a Moonbreon in here? No, not the first That's one. Energy. energy. Next one. We got Eevee. Uh-oh. Going into a Pikachu. Okay. Cutie Fly. Applin. And... Oh, oh. <laughs> so close. Not really, but I tried. I tried, but... This Venusaur. Now, Danny, I know you spent a long time trying to open up this package. I don't think I want to spend as long. Don't cut the card. And, oh, it's in a top loader, so I would have oh, been, okay. been fine. Yeah, I would have been fine. Oh, there we go. Venusaur EX Special Illustration. So that means we got to add both of these in. Oh, yes. Right over here. 
one more card, and then Pokemon 151 is complete. We'll have a complete Pokemon 151 set after Mr. Mime, none other than our friend Javi coming through. Who You've seen Javi in many uh, of our Pokemon uh, Night videos, but coming through with the last card that we need. So a big thank you to Javi. All right, here we go. On the count of three. Three, two, one. Whoop. Pokemon 151 is officially complete. We no longer need any more cards. We can close the binder, put it on the shelf, and that breaking family, that is a Pokemon journey. Breaking family, that's it for today's Pokemon video. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Check out the rest of the videos right over there. We'll see you all in the next video. And don't forget, we love every single one of you all around the world. Do it with us now. Peace, love, and a high five.